Hello and welcome to Jobber Gaming. My name is Jordan. We're back with uh, Shadowrun Returns uh, Let's Play. And we're back at the docks. Uh, we're supposed to meet Shannon Half Sky. She's right here. And we're going to go find who is the killer of her brother. So we hired these other uh, Shadowrunners. And up, oh, there's a problem because. There are people that have taken over the place, so that's really weird. Y y you there. This block is off limits. There's a... We've got a gas leak on the docks here. Uh, no loitering. <laughs> this guy doesn't look like the one one of the hired mercenaries. Hey, are you listening? Get out of here. Uh, I'll go the etiquette shadow runner. Really, guy? They aren't paying you enough, especially not once Lone Star sends a response team. Yeah. Frack. I knew she was lying. Told me they jammed all the Lone Star channels. Damn it, I'm out. Shh, there's one less death on my hands. Well, whoa. A lot of Lone Star people got killed today. Let's see if I can surprise anybody. Ooh, is there no? Nope. Oh, there we go. Shit. Hmm. Okay, let's see. Should I go for... You know what? I will go for... I don't want to... Whatever. I'll go attack him. Yep, yeah, one more time, please. Thank you. <coughs> um, What does she have? That, that. Increase friendly targets AP by one. What if I... Is he not in sight? Oh. Okay. Nope. Um, what's this? Mana Bolt. What are these? Summon a force to nature element. Hmm. That's interesting. But not what I want. Uh, De Morgana. She is my... What is she again? Hmm. I think she's just a regular... Run-of-the-mill kind of killer. Oh, she's my Decker. Sorry. Uh, wow, she can't hit shit. Okay. Well, maybe I was wrong. <laughs> she hit that. Um, let's see. Where to go? Where to go? Where to go? Uh, why don't we get big guy over here? Mm, unless I move the big guy. Where am I going to... Hmm. How do I do this? I could maybe put him here. Yeah, I'll put him here. And Shannon Half Sky, I'll put you over here, and then I'll take another. I'll take a shot at this one here. Maybe I can get him. Maybe if I do that to increase the chance. Yeah, there we go. Now the most important thing is I don't want to get flanked. Uh, take him out. There we go. Um. I'll park my keister here. You, Shannon Half Sky. Uh, what do I do? Where do I put her? Because I. Oh, you know what? I'll put her all the way over here. Like I said, so I don't get flanked. Uh, you just shoot him. Oh, you missed? Come on, man. Seriously. Uh, not so good. Um, let's. Can we use the drone? How do I use the drone? I want to use the drone. Uh, okay. Drone combat. Ah, okay, perfect. Um, on. There we go. I will move up. Ah, I missed. <laughs> That's okay. Um, let's just shoot a firebolt. You're probably not going to hit squad. Oh, I stand corrected. <laughs> oh, come on, man. Don't heal up. I'm trying to kill you. I'm singing Kumbaya songs. Okay, I will... Hmm. If I go to this, and what if I... Oh, wow. That might not even work. If I just do that. Yeah, that worked. Damn it. OK. 
Okay, Shannon Half Sky. I'm gonna come here and shoot you. Shoot you, friend. <laughs> Oof. If only that actually killed him. Seriously. Um. Oh, she has no other gun. Okay. Reload. Mmm. You. Just shoot a fireball. I didn't expect that to hit. But, uh. Huh. Let's see. Let's improve that. Aim. Perfect. One more shot, baby. Yes. Score. That hurt. Um. Let's just shoot him. Oh, for shit's sakes. Can I can I attack him? Yeah, I'll just hit him. Okay. Um Let's move you over here. And I let's see if I can get the drop on you know what? Actually No, I can't. Ooh. Let's do a mana bolt. Nice. Okay, that's good. He's got what? How much health? Oh, he's got actually quite a bit of health. Uh, let's just try and shoot him. Although, she can't hit shit. I'm not taking this girl again. Uh, can you... Ooh. Let's do the fire, baby. Oh, my God. That was a lot of damage. As soon as the last murder kiss the ground, the docks become eerily silent. Alright, let's... I got the warehouse key. Very nice. Um, let's go in. Spirit talk. You head inside the darkened warehouse with Shannon. Her eyes have that far-off gaze associated with looking into the astral plane. When the world changed, the Native American tribes made a resurgence as well, demanding a place in the new world. They got it. The Salish... Uh, Sheed uh, Council now represents 8.6 million Amerindians across a multitude of tribes. Salish, Maka, Sin, Sirak, and others. They've adapted to the awakening better than other nations thanks to a deeper connection to the world, both physical and spiritual. You can see the con that connection uh, alive in Shannon now. You notice the shift in her focus as she turns to the present. She nods to you. She can sense the spirits in this place. Now you just need to find them. Find that data. You're dead meat. Okay. But, but I don't know what I want to do. Just want to give you a hug. No, I'm kidding. Um. Does additional damage when AP ignores the weapon damage? Negative ten percent. No, I'm just gonna hit him. And one more, one more, one more. Yes. Uh, oh, I should have given this guy a bonus. Then maybe I can have him hit her again. Yes, yes, yes. Damn it. Missed. Um, this Morgana girl. Let's go here. God, she's, this girl's useless. Um, where to put him though? That's where I'm... If I put him here, yeah. And let's get your robot up and going. There we go. Let's just move this guy up a little bit to get a better shot. Nice. Yeah, that's right. Run for cover. Uh oh. That's not so good. Oh boy. Oh boy, that's holy shit! I'm really surrounded. Okay, uh, this is weird. Um, what if I go for my gun though? I go for this. Now I'm kind of happy I did that. <laughs> I'm really happy I did that. Ninety-nine. Damn straight, I'm gonna shoot him. Uh, Shannon Half Sky. Ooh, let's do the lightning bolt, baby. Oh, that was a weak shot. Hmm. Okay, let's try and improve the aim. Yes. Okay, now, you, Morgan. Okay, that didn't do much. 
That didn't do much either. You, you're really shitty. Uh, flamethrower. Yes, please. Seriously? You useless twat. Shoot him again. Thank you. Huh. She's scared and running. Oh. That's not cool. Not cool at all. Um, I think I'm going to get my machete out, teach this guy a lesson. Uh, yep, 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 yep. Seriously. There we go. Even better. Um, yeah, just see if I can shoot him once. Shoot him twice. Nope. Okay. De Morgan. Can she shoot this? You know what? Go. Oh, wait. Let's uh, use the robot. Come on. Give me a hit. <sighs> what to do? Nope. Um, this is not. You're not helpful. Dude. So not helpful right now. 58%. See if I can hit him. Yes! Yes! Alright, my turn to re Actually, I really need to heal myself. Uh, but, ah. Oh, the heals. Uh, I'm actually already kind of behind cover, so I'm going to take my gun out. Let's improve the. Oh. Okay, we won't. And uh, let's give him another shot for two rounds. Thank you. Sweet. One more to get. Oh. Reload. Again, I'm really, I'm not getting her again. She's, I don't find her very useful, to be honest. Can I shoot this one? Hmm. I'll just move him up. It's not like he's gonna do anything, really. Uh, let's move this little machine up. Get a hit, get a hit. Yes! Sco oh. Shit, there's still, uh, really? Okay. Let's just peek our head inside. Shannon, come over here. Well, she's my Decker, so she's supposed to be helpful for that, I suppose, but, uh, hmm. Let's just have her come over here. Nope, nothing there. Come on. Wounded drone. Well, I'm going to have to go in here, I think. I think this is the only place I can go. Where? And I thought I could get in there, but apparently not. Okay, you, my friend. Thank God I have, uh the extra boost of uh, AP. <coughs> now, I'm going to put her here. De Morgana. I wonder if I even needed a Decker in this freaking thing. <laughs> if I didn't, I'm going to be kind of annoyed with myself, to be honest. Oh, I want to put him... Oh, come on. No. 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 Yes. Okay. Um, should I have him open the door? Why, why not? Okay. I'm going to heal myself real quick. Because I'm a big guy, but uh, I need the heals. I also should reload the weapon, too. Um... I'm going to give this big guy some extra AP so he can move more. You will come here. And you uh, can come uh, just inside here. I don't want him to go all the way. And you, my little robot. Uh, let's put him, park him here. Whoop. And that's why I put him into some cover. Okay, mm, I will 
I have to, if I sit my keister here, or here, I'm gonna put him here. Okay, let's put her here. Now, hopefully, I won't get like just randomly wrecked because that would be really annoying. Uh, I'll have to hide her behind a box, which I don't know why it's such saying it's not giving her cover. Because it should be. Uh, I will have him go all the way up here, although that might end up getting him killed. Uh, this, I'll bring the machine up closer and shoot. There we go. Uh oh, this, although, that was dumb. Shotgun guy is gonna hit me. That's okay, it's okay. We got this, we got this. Alright, let's see if we can. No, that's not high enough. Hmm. Wait, what if I what if I did do this though? Yeah, that didn't that didn't uh, go so well. <laughs> Let's do a fire bolt though. Seriously? Why didn't that do more? What? Okay, can you seriously? You don't even have line of sight. Oh my lord. Okay, I'm gonna have to move her up, and maybe if I get a shot. Why can't she hit shit? And why can't you hit anything, you old pizza? There we go. That's more like it. Drone, my friend. Drone, fire. Good. And he doesn't know what he's doing. <laughs> okay. Reload. Let's change to this mode. Should I expose myself? Well, if I move closer, I might be able to. Oh. Wait, can. Oh, bunny rabbit's ready. Good. Good, 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 good. Um, 70, what? 72% now? Oh, wow. That, that, uh. Wasn't very helpful. Uh oh. Um. You're, you're useless, troll. You're not hitting shit. Maybe this will work. Come on. Oh, yeah. 20 damage. Now that's more like it. Um. Uh, let's put him here. Give him a tidbit of cover. All right. We were here first, assholes. This is our score. Yeah, sorry, bro. I'm here too. That's pretty sad that I took that many times to shoot him. I'll just, oh, you know what? I'll just go all the way out. I got no choice. Sweet, last one. Follow me. Aries flight recorder. Hmm, interesting. See, this is why you loot the dead bodies. Is there anything here of interest? Mm. I'm holding the alt button, but noop, 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 noop. Alright, that's okay. Let's talk to some dead bodies. Ooh. Forgot. Forgotten souls. God, this looks like um, the girl in the ring, kind of, or like her cousin or something. The air grows cold and the spirits of dead children coalesce from the vapor of your breath. Their cherubic faces, uh, cherubic, 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 uh, cherub, cherubic, cherubic faces are burned and their lips quiver as if they are about to cry. But their eyes are round and vacant, and they glare at you now, unblinking. Oof, oof, gives me a shiver. We are the innocents who have perished in the flames, choking on smoke as we fell from the sky, crying for our mothers. You bring anchors to your world, which was once home to us, and we will use them to testify. Show the first magical fetish. We no longer see the world of flesh seeker. 
Only the essence and auras of living things, words though, words may echo through the veil, and sometimes, sometimes we may hear them. Last night this place was filled with a scream that went on and on, drawing us to it. It was a man crying out for a witness as he died, and so we came to bear witness, but fled in terror before the malevolent spirit that profaned the man's remains. The spirit was other. It was not of this place. It had twisted its way through the veil and through the dark to come here. <laughs> When the other had gone, and we returned to our vigil, we found two creatures of flesh. One you would call an elf, unsullied by technology, and able to channel the energies of the cosmos. Yet his spirit was corrupted from within. He was dark and twisted, yet not like the other, so we did not flee. The second we knew to be a troll. Ribbons of his essence had been flayed from him, oof, leaving cold machinery behind. His aura was the aura of one simple and confused. Between elf and troll lay the remains of the man whose sister now chanced to us for justice. The elf, his essence remains in this place where the man died. Something has been left behind, a small part of him, perhaps. Uh, spirit, can you tell us any more? The spirit begins to fade, all but the one. Its eyes harden and it takes full measure of you as if to commit everything about you to memory. No, we must, we must not stay. With the spirits gone, the young shaman releases her hold on the magical tether connecting her to the other realm. She reels from the backlash or perhaps from the emotional toll of knowing her brother's last moments. They saw him. They were with him when he died. You alright? She takes a series of controlled breaths. Only shuddering with the first few. No, but I will be. I I don't want that for him. Not what those poor souls have endured. My brother deserves to be free. Uh, let's see. <laughs> we do now what we do for the week. What we do now we do for the living. Um, he uh, can't be much more free than death. He will be once we find his killer. How about that? Yes, the elf and the troll. We have to find that piece of the elf the spirit spoke of. It's our best hope of stopping this. I wish I could do a Native American accent. I can practice, I suppose. Uh, maybe we find a piece around here. Ooh. DNA evidence. Okay. Blood. This is what the spirits wanted to, to find us to find. The piece of my brother's killer. It's not much but it's just enough. She scowls at it, looking every bit like she intends to reach through the small sample and dismember its owner from afar. And perhaps she can. Um, is that enough to target a spell? Can you track him with that? Yeah, can you track him with that? I can, given enough time. But I'm still feeling quite drained. I'll need to rest before I can try anything so involved. When I'm able... I'll commune with Bear, consult the spirits, and do what must be done. But in the meantime, you might take some portion of the sample to pursue a more conventional avenue of attack. Well, I do have some friends that might be able to help. Good. Let me know if you learn anything about this elf and troll pair. And you should find them. I want to be there when they are brought low. I want to see the light leave their eyes for my brother. Um... Yeah, there's no one else I would rather have by my side. She was pretty useful. She was pretty useful. Kind of annoyed, though. I can't, like, do more. But whatever. Or more secrets or goodies. Let's go. Yes. After hours. When you return to the seamstress's union in the early hours of the morning, it seems a completely different place. Bereft of the normal crowd that haunts it, the bar feels desolate, almost abandoned. It's eerie, like the back hallways of hotels and shopping malls. But you finally have a break in your case, a sample of the Ripper's blood. You just need to find someone who, to help you analyze it. Well, I'm sure the Doc can help, no? Or Dresden, maybe? 
Without its colorful staff, cast of regulars, and posing tourists, the Union feels hollow. The front bar and lounge are deserted, except for a handful of janitors. Ah, it's the janitors. Mrs. Kubota is in the back. Gotta what now? After that one, Miss Johnny Clean, I'm, I worry about the janitors. Gathered around the intimate back bar, Mrs. Kubota and her cautery gathered for breakfast, with the later herself doing the cooking. Huh. The smell of soy calf and something resembling sausages fills the room. Alright. What's in these sausages? You don't want to know. Ohio, would you like some? Forgive me, Ome, but you look like hell. Um, thanks, just the welcome I was looking for. <laughs> yeah. She looks you over, noting the signs of your nocturnal activities. She nods. Any run you can walk away from is a good run. Well, I, it uh, helps with the other team doesn't walk away. <laughs> no one to follow you, that's true. <laughs> I can tell you have been busy, and I can see, oh. I can tell you have been busy, and I can see by the look on your face that there is something you need. Is there, is this about the Reaper? Yep, I found the DNA. Evidence, and I need help analyzing. Ah, oh, yes, more karma. What? what? Uh, that is excellent. We will unlock the piano so you may go downstairs. I am certain someone in the safe house will be able to help you if they are awake. It is likely that you will visit the Matrix before the day is done. Uh, may I take a sausage? Take the whole plate. Yes, I got some sausages. Hey, Mr. Cluwe. Evening, sir. What's the word around town, Mr. Cluwe? There's been more talk of the Ripper killings. Some people are saying they're hate crimes on account of the victims all being humans. Mm, most people are ignorant bastards. Well, I wouldn't go for that. Go that far. <laughs> people are just too quick to label something a hate crime. Check the census. The city is still 66% human. Close your eyes and throw a rock. You're more than likely to hit a human. Doesn't make it a hate crime. It's still a crime, though. And that's, that should be enough. This is the first real rise you've seen out of Mc Mr. Cluey, but he reins himself in with a roll of his thick shoulders and a smoothing of his jacket. Don't worry, not going to start throwing rocks. Wouldn't want to reinforce the stereotype. I'll leave you to your business, sir. Yes, you will. Thank you very much. Let's go downstairs. You've been doing a lot of legwork on this job, but it's going to require a trip to cyberspace and back to ID the Ripper. The Matrix, the cybernetic analog of Inside the Grid. The World Wide Computer Met Network, a digital world, information brought to life. Inside cyberspace, your avatar does all the work while your meat body is left behind. All around your avatar are pathways to other nodes filled with data, IC, counter-intrusion programs, and other jacked-in runners. Cyberspace has many dangers as the meat world and more. Locked doors, security countermeasures, and black IC that can fly that can fry a Decker's brain. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Every moment you make in the Matrix can be tracked. If you aren't careful, get dump shocked out and your brain gets fuzzy for a bit. Get hit by an enemy Decker and you die. Well, I feel like, well, the Matrix, this, it, this makes me think of Tron, to be honest, more than anything. Um, I think, though, I will leave it here for now and then we'll come back. Um, I... Because I have a f strong feeling we're going to have a, a big uh, quest uh, mission coming up. So I'm going to leave it for now. Thanks a lot, guys, for watching. Uh, I really appreciate it. Uh, please like, support. Sh uh, can't speak. Please like, share, uh, comment, and subscribe. It is both appreciated and helps to support the channel. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.